you're creating content, maybe you're doing it in different forms. Um, if you're using my content co-working method uh, and you're kind of like speaking your content on video, you might end up having a written, you know, auto-generated written transcript, which you turn into a blog post. You have a video as file as well, and then you may also have a separate audio file. So what do you do? The audio, you know, the written transcript, of course, can be turned into a blog post or social media post. The video, of course, can be, you know, either you upload it directly to YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook, and LinkedIn, whichever ones you use, you don't have to do all of them. Um, but I, I would say, I would say pick two, you know, pick one is wherever you get the most uh, engagement on your content. Um, think about uploading it there. And then secondly, upload it also to YouTube um, because YouTube is a little bit like playing the lottery. You just know, yeah, I mean, you have to play enough that yeah, lottery is a bad, bad example because lottery is like one out of like 20 million or 30 million chance that you'll win. But with YouTube, it's better than that. It's only one out of 20,000 chance you'll win. <laughs> <laughs> or something like that. So no, I mean, I would say, you know, I uploaded a thousand videos and I won like um, probably a dozen times. So it's like a, it's like a, what, like a 1% chance of winning on YouTube. And by one, I mean, like you upload a thousand videos, you probably have 10 of them go viral, you know, just because of like chance of the keyword. If you do some keyword research, that's, that's helpful for the, for the, uh, the title. But even if you don't do keyword research, just like out of a thousand titles, <laughs> some of them are going to go viral. So it's almost, it's, it's just, it's like, it's like dumb luck. If you just do it like the way I do it. Um, you know, I'm a little too lazy to do keyword research when it comes to YouTube videos. But anyway, long story short, with video, you upload A to one place where you know you're going to get encouragement and, and feedback. So for most of us, that's Facebook profile where your friends and family see it. Uh, for some of us, it's the Instagram account. For others, it might even be LinkedIn. So pick one place that you're going to get encouragement. And, and secondly, um, you know, put it on YouTube just for the whole lottery, lottery thing, uh, discoverability. Uh, YouTube is good for Google SEO as well because Google loves YouTube. So, and then the third one, audio, um, uh, you know, if you don't have a podcast, then you could just discard the audio for now. If it, if it was a really good audio segment, maybe you save it in your Google Drive so that in the future, when you do have a podcast, you could pick that up and just drop it in as an episode. So, I hope that helps as a quick way to think about the, the, the three formats and then, uh, and then uh, yeah, we can continue the discussion. And in terms of the rhythm of these things, um, text is generally the best way to test ideas just written because everyone can quickly read it and see if they resonate and they do, they'll engage with it. Video is harder to test ideas unless it's a one minute video that people can see how short it is. So they might give 20 seconds to it to see if they, they wanna keep watching for the next 40 seconds plus. Um, so, it, you know, I would, for simplicity, I would put the text first. And if it does, if it does well, meaning better, average or better than compared to your other stuff, then you say, well, okay, let me think about, uh, maybe I'll, I'll post a video version of this after a while. Now it's, it's um, you know, so have a schedule for yourself to say, okay, week one, I'm gonna post a text. Week two, I'm gonna post a video if it does well, you know, so kind of have that alternating, you know, it's like, it's like okay, this week, uh, you know, let's say I do content on Wednesdays. Well, okay, Wednesday's my content day, okay. Um, if, let me, let me look back at one week ago, the text that I posted, did it do well? It did well. Okay, let me, today, I'll go ahead and post a video, but I will also go ahead and post uh, the text for the next testing. So let me know if that helps. I'm assuming you only do content one day a week. Hopefully, mo hopefully you all are doing it more than that. Then you could split up the text and video into different days. So let me know if that helps.